Greg Taylor, thanks for checking me out on the new marketing show and Instagram TV. So today we're talking about email marketing. And it's a topic we don't really talk all that much about and I think that we need to pay more attention. We spend a lot of time crafting personas and we spend a lot of time crafting behaviors for you know, our online, our social media audience, our web audience, but we don't talk enough about that. Too often we see people treat their whole list in one manner and what ends up happening is you alienate the people who are highly engaged or you alienate the people who aren't that engaged or you alienate the people who aren't engaged at all and out of everyone that segment matters the least because if they're not engaged they're not engaged so if you're able to segment your list if you're able to craft messages for people who open your your email all the time versus somebody who's on your list that doesn't open an email. If you can work with subject lines, maybe ask a question, do some good call to action stuff to pique interest, I think you're gonna start to see a, a higher open rate. And once you get the emails open, then you can work on a click-through rate. So the way that we tackle this is work on your list. So what we're in fact, we're, we're doing by change in lists by moving people along from one list to another because they've opened an email or interacted with the brand is now we're able to concentrate on the content and the, and the click-through rate on that. That's the most important metric on that segment. The other segment, the people who don't open the list as often, work on the click-through rate I'm sorry, work on the open rate there because then what you can do in time is you can move them along and then start to focus on the click through rate. So the two things you wanna focus on. One, the open rate. Treat people who open your emails differently than people who do not. Then concentrate and focus on the goal and the metric of the click through rate there. Two, focus on getting people to open your emails and once that's open, then you can move them along where they can be into the bucket of the highly engaged. So treat people the way that they want to be treated. Treat people as accordingly and according to their behavior. And I think that you're going to start seeing your email data and your email marketing make a little bit more sense. So we're going to do some more talks on this, definitely. So thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later. Bye.